Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. If you are a car owner, you might have come across the EPC light on your dashboard. But what does it mean? Today, we're diving into the causes of the EPC light and what you can do about it. EPC stands for Electronic Power Control. The EPC light is a warning indicator found in Volkswagen Group vehicles. When the EPC light comes on, it indicates an issue within the vehicle's throttle system. Causes of the EPC light 1. Faulty throttle body The throttle body controls the amount of air that enters the engine by opening and closing the throttle valve. If the throttle body is dirty, sticking, or malfunctioning, it can send incorrect signals to the engine control unit, disrupting the air-fuel mixture. This inconsistency triggers the EPC light as the ECU detects an issue with the throttle system. 2. Vacuum Leaks Leaks in the intake manifold or vacuum system allow unmetered air to enter the engine. This disrupts the air-fuel mixture, leading to performance issues. The engine control unit detects these irregularities and triggers the EPC light to indicate a problem with the engine's intake system. 3. Faulty Engine Control Unit The engine control unit is the brain of the vehicle's engine management system. It controls various functions, including throttle control. A malfunctioning ECU can misinterpret sensor data or fail to manage the throttle system correctly, triggering the EPC light. 4. Bad Brake Pedal Switch The brake pedal switch is responsible for detecting when the brake pedal is pressed and sending this information to the vehicle's ECU. If the brake pedal switch is faulty, it might send incorrect signals to the engine control unit. This can confuse the ECU, leading it to believe there is an issue with the braking or throttle system. 5. Electrical Issues the EPC system relies on various electrical connections and circuits. Short circuits, damaged wires, or poor connections can disrupt communication between the sensors and the ECU. This can cause the EPC light to come on as the system detects irregularities in the electrical signals. 6. Bad Throttle Position Sensor The throttle position sensor monitors the position of the throttle valve and sends this data to the engine control unit. If this sensor becomes faulty, it starts to send wrong information to the ECU. In such condition, the ECU can't accurately control the throttle, causing the EPC light to come on. 7. Bad Mass Airflow Sensor The MAF sensor measures the amount of air entering the engine. If the MAF sensor becomes faulty, it may cause incorrect air-fuel mixture readings, leading to the EPC light being illuminated. 8. Low or Dirty Engine Oil Engine oil lubricates and cools various engine components. Low or dirty oil can lead to increased friction, overheating, and potential damage to the engine. The ECU monitors oil levels and quality, and if it detects an issue, it may trigger the EPC light as a precaution. When the EPC light is illuminated, it is essential to diagnose and address the underlying issue promptly. Continued driving with the EPC light on can lead to reduced engine performance, potential damage, and compromised safety. It is recommended to have the vehicle inspected by a professional mechanic or a dealership service center to accurately diagnose and resolve the problem. That's it for today's video on the causes of the EPC light. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more automotive tips and tutorials. And if you have any questions or experiences with the EPC light, leave a comment below. Thanks for watching, and drive safe.